name is Jordan Kessinger, and I'm here with the female athlete of the week, Peyton Marr, for another episode of Wacky Question Wednesday. Question number one, Peyton, do you see you or any of your track teammates making another state appearance this year? Um, I definitely have to say the girls 4x8 definitely has a chance at going to state this year. If you had the superpower to shape shift into different animals, which animal would you choose to shape shift into and why? I think I'd be a giraffe because <laughs> I could be taller than everybody else and pick leaves. Good. What is your favorite event in track this year? Um, I have to say the 400. Why? Because it gets over the quickest. <laughs> Four. There was a big scratch on your leg last week. Would you like to elaborate and explain this to us, please? Um, there was a bear, and uh, I fought it. Question number five, you are a sophomore this year. How do you feel about being an upperclassman next year and uh, about the seniors getting ready to leave? Um, kind of scares me a little bit because I have no friends besides the seniors, so I'm going to be a little lost next year. <laughs> Question number six, what is your favorite TV show and why? Law and Order SVU. Um, because <laughs> I don't know, I just kind of like it. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Number seven, would you do better in a lip singing, air guitar, or dancing competition? Um, definitely a lip singing competition. Question number one, how is your baseball season going this year? Uh, you know, our record isn't that great, but I think that uh, our team is young and so we're building for the future and we're playing well going into conference, so I think we're going to be ready and we're going to win some games. Question number two, what is the weirdest thing that's ever happened to you at a baseball game? Well, there was a kid that peed himself uh, while we were playing and had to go to the bathroom and hold the whole game, and so we all laughed at him and made fun of him. That was pretty interesting. Question number three. How do you feel about being moped man? Well, uh, I think that real only savage people uh, get to drive mopeds, and the fact that you only pay $2 for gas is, is pretty great, so you know, I'm, I'm pretty proud of it, to be honest. Question number four, seniors are getting ready to leave and graduate for good and you're moving up next year. How do you feel about this? Uh, you know, I'm going to miss the seniors, but at the same time, it's going to be fun having our group of juniors lead, and so it'll be a transition, and I, I think we're going to take them under our wing and do well. Number five, if you could have any superpower, what would it be and why? I'd probably like to like, be invisible because then you could like sneak into like places and like you know, see like your celebrities like Mila Kunis, my woman crush, and you can just see them and won't even know you're there. Question number six. So prom was last weekend. Would you like to show us your favorite dance move? Yeah, I'd like to say uh, the whip. I just hit the little boom like that. It's my favorite dance move. Would you be able to win a lip singing, a dancing, or an air guitar competition? Lip syncing, most definitely, without a doubt.
Go. <laughs>